There we go. As the voltage goes up just a tad, the current will start to follow. Put a diode in line so it wasn't reading the voltage of the battery bank. That way I could tell what's going on. We're getting some power. I'm not greedy. Oh, wow. There's our wind indicator right there. Sunlight's pretty bright. Getting good solar today. Around six miles an hour, I start getting power, and eight miles an hour, I really start getting power. And I haven't gotten any wind larger than that yet to tell you. I'm sure it's going to go up better. There we are. I put the 15 amp meter in line because I wanted to be able to see it. I have the 50 amp meter I got with it. But, and then if the current goes up too high, I just hit the switch, shorts out that meter, and that way it protects that meter. So these are actually both in line, but the 50 amp. I don't get a lot of indication on it, which I would if it was up in the air. It's not up on a tower like it's supposed to be. It's just up on my pole barn, but that's all I wanted. I'm just playing with it. Down the road, I'll build me a tower or something. This thing teases me. I'll hear it start to whine. I'll run over here because I work here. <laughs> as soon as I get here, the window will go down. I'm going to build a LED light or something put up on top of this. So I can see an indication where I don't have to run over here because I can't read the meters from where I work. <laughs> That's it. We're in Michigan, not by any coast. We're north of Detroit, about 70 miles. North of Flint, about 20. 